there seems to be a lot of people out there who, for some reason, don't understand why so many people are terrified of the Trump presidency. Or you, you, or that's the reason why you like the Trump presidency, because it does terrify um, those who really enjoyed having a, a nice country. Um, that was well liked in the world to at least some degree. I mean, there's always been countries that have generally had some animosity, but not like now, right? But Trump doesn't compromise. See, Trump is Trump is playing the part of a president. He's chosen Republican. And so he's, he's doing everything that a good Republican is supposed to do. Pat, pat him on the head, right? Pat him on the head. Oh, yes, you're, you're doing the, the, the right thing. Let me give you a sucker. Let me give you a, a, a pony. Do you want a pony? Do you want your own pony? Oh, that'd be great. But right now it's... I, I did the right thing, and I'm not being patted on the head. I, I did the right thing. I'm doing the Republican thing. I'm doing the right thing. That's how Trump is acting, right? He doesn't really care. His, his, his reality of, of, of what the right thing is is based off of characters in his mind of how um, you you play a part. That's what it's all about. Do the presidential hokey pokey, and you turn yourself about. You know that's what it's all about to him, and. People aren't liking it, and he's just, you You have to like it. I've went through all the motions, and I, I have all the money, and I and I got, I got elected, and, and people like me. And then the more that he says it, the, the, the less that people like him. And, but, but you have to like me. I, I've done everything the right way. Anyway, he doesn't compromise. A president's job, part of a president's job is to compromise. If you're not doing that, what the fuck? Why the fuck are you the president when you're not doing any compromising? There has to be some compromising. Now, sometimes the, the problem that Democrats seem to have is they, they, instead of compromising when they already have an idea, but then they, they'll bring it up to the other side and then make a compromise then, they'll compromise before they bring it up to the right. Well, the right doesn't compromise before they, they bring it up to the left. They just they just push it forth. So that's something the left needs to, to learn to do a little more. I mean, still compromise, but don't water it down before you've even brought it to the right. Okay? And that's... But with Trump, there is no compromising at all. And he, he's like... He's like that boss who just wants yes-men around him. He doesn't want anyone questioning anything that he says or does. Do you know what that makes someone? It makes them maybe not technically label-wise because of the, the, the name of the position they're in, but if they use that position a particular way, then it makes them a dictator. Trump is running, is, is going with the presidency like a dictator and thinks that as long as you push forth these Republican values and, and cozy up to all of the most extreme elements of the Republican Party, oh, it'll be the right thing and, and that should bring the country together. No, no, compromising will, will be the, bring the, brings the country together. You need to be able to, to work with people on both sides and come up with a solution that works at least somewhat decently for everyone. But that's not what he does. 
And so if there was a, 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 a left winger who wanted to ban guns and, and make hate speech illegal and make it so that the government was to uh, uh, take over all corporations and that sort of thing, and it looked like they were they were you know going to pass those things. You guarantee it's a guarantee that you'd be calling for the impeachment of that president. Let's make no mistake about it. If Bill Clinton can, you know, you can try to impeach him over having not not telling the truth about. A sexual encounter between two consenting adults, then, it, you know, a president that's really destroying the country by being the most partisan as possible and making no compromises, yeah, it, it seems like that's a little bit more important than a goddamn sex act. 